Hi, uh, today I am explaining about uh, letter heads. Okay, so previous class already we discussed about uh, these business cards <coughs> or visiting cards. Okay, so I will explain today uh, letter heads. So, letter head standard size, suppose here I am giving name a uh, letter heads L E T T E L letter letter head. Okay. The number of artboards here I uh, am taking suppose yeah we do uh, two types yes okay and here uh, the size is uh, A4 size will take okay A4 size is width to 11.69 by 8.27 inches okay and this is a uh, vertical vertically I am using this okay so there is no bleed suppose uh, this business cards sorry uh, this letter hats we use for printing so CMYK and resolution is 300 save okay yes and these are the two letter hats I am planning okay yeah letter hats are generally what uh, for the official correspondence we use so one company to another company okay uh, for their uh, text or for their uh, uh, message what they are expecting from the other company they write everything on on paper okay that to an A4 size paper instead of using uh, normal plain A4 size paper the companies industries the management people okay, officially they use their printed papers that to on a4 size they print their logo here here somewhere they use their logo and suppose the address details and contact details they print on a4 size sg2 bond okay so instead of normal uh, uh, white paper they use sg2 a bond paper on that they print their logo and address details and contact details they print okay so those they use okay so uh, generally these letterheads uh, we know about these letterheads generally suppose uh, for the appointment letters and the offer letters companies they used to give uh, these papers letterheads they put it they fold it okay uh, in a two fold they fold this uh, letterhead and keep there is in a, uh, a cover okay and they uh, offer the letters to the employee or candidates okay so these are official uh, correspondence letters so we have to design suppose uh, for that I want my logo suppose I'm using this logo this is my logo control C and come here and paste control V okay so make it bit bigger okay for timing keep this keep this here okay for the uh, letterhead design generally we use this left alignment and sometimes we use center alignment suppose this is our center of the page we use we use at center of the page okay and here we type our uh, the details okay address details and all and mention your web details or email or uh, contact number also we provide okay right suppose here now I'm planning a central alignment with central alignment I'm planning for that we want 
these details control C make it control V paste okay so here these must be okay, uh, for timing um, I'm using some blue text so that blue also this blue I'm use I'm using this blue okay right select this and use that fill okay this is but the text also here I'm using in the central element because we are planning everything in central element okay so this is central element okay and now uh, we have to give the web suppose email is there here we have to give the contact number for the contact number here I'm planning okay so this uh, make it bit smaller yes bit smaller okay. move up yes this also you can move up mm. control S Okay. Uh, give the name. Shadow Illustrator assignment. Uh, assignment three. Creating a letterhead. L e t t e r. L e missing. A letterhead letterhead Adobe Illustrator assignment 3 letterhead design make it letterhead design ok save ok now what I am doing I am giving my so you can uh, group this group control C and come here and paste okay so this is this is my uh, contact number suppose ungroup here and giving the uh, double space for this I'm giving double space comma zero four zero eight nine three two three six five seven two so
ungroup mean group this group this and suppose this I'm moving upwards and this I'm dragging down dragging down yes and now you can drag this also yes okay so you can select everything I can make this is a horizontal align center okay and uh, the font size give the font size bit bigger suppose 18 size okay and you can move this symbol ungroup first you can move this here and make it bit bigger right and you can select everything and now use the horizontal align center and suppose you can check this vertical distribute center and now control Z yeah this first we have to group this group select everything yes suppose vertical it distribute center yes but this is not center you can select everything and you can make horizontal align center but still it is uh, not in center this can check sometimes vertical distribute center can sometimes use this manually also move down bit move down and you can move this down ok so I mentioned specially a uh, contact number with uh, some red color yes and here also I maintain the double space drag bit aside okay right and you can select everything and make it group group yes okay
okay control yes now here uh, what i'm do what i'm doing here uh, i use some rectangle box okay and i can fill with a gray color yes okay so now can make down or otherwise i'll keep there okay and i can uh, reduce this size suppose up to here okay and up to here you can uh, copy this control c control shift v and you can drag that this side you can maintain the same gap both side okay so this is and suppose you can move more right suppose uh, this is one kind of design but uh, i don't like this it's not interesting yes for this here uh, make this set patch yeah this is interesting okay so this is a uh, letter head i'll make a uh, one more duplicate of this control c control shift v okay so i duplicated that but here a fill color with uh, this blue okay i fill with this blue but can change this yes now what i'll do this this i'll send back arrange and send back this note went back uh, so arrange 
and send back round it's not going up So what I do? This grey color. Bring to front. Yes. Yes. This is. Okay. This is uh, one of my design for letterhead. The two lines. It is not looking good. One I'll remove. Yes. This is simple and uh, nice looking. Okay, here the text uh, again. I want to even shade dark color. Yes, this is nice. Otherwise, make it bit lighter. Not that much. Mm, yes, this is nice. Okay, so this. I'll Ungroup this and I'll increase the size of this. Yes. Now we can select this entire portion. Right click and group. Yeah, group. Now control S. Okay, this is uh, one uh, design of letterhead. Now uh, we are planning the second design. Control C or otherwise with the Alt by press Alt get the duplicate of that. Okay, yes, now I'm planning with the left alignment. So I'm keeping here. Now this entire uh, text will be there. I'll keep here. Yes, this is then move this here. you can use a uh, rollers also yes now you delete the roller okay so this is my one more uh, letterhead and I'm planning uh, more to suppose what I'll do I'll copy one more okay the same way take one more Okay. 
okay here uh, two or now I'm planning differently again I'll keep this number here select everything and do this left alignment okay now here what I'll do I'll make a box here this is box this is box So this is can send back, arrange and send back. Otherwise, yeah, this this text can make it white. Okay, so this is white. So for both sides also, okay. So align all the sides. This text, uh, suppose move down, bait down, okay, control S, okay. this is one uh, style. So, one more uh, the design I'm planning. this up and you drag this here select this make it center okay make down more down can get here suppose this and this and the both are the same yeah our text is gone mm, this so to control C control V this is gone this you have to move here yes okay, this is central alignment and this is a left alignment I'm using suppose uh, left alignment and I use a patch okay and here uh, the logo the same logo control C and control paste I'm keeping this logo here okay so 
you ungroup this you can remove this okay and now you can make bigger make it bigger size and keep here So here uh, reduce the opacity of this because I want very uh, dull look. Okay. Yes, the opacity transparency must be very low. Yes. Now control S. Okay. So these are the uh, four different uh, letter heads we did. So letter heads are basically what I'm repeating again uh, for the correspondence purpose, official correspondence. These companies, industries, and all the official people uh, they use for their uh, to put the text on paper instead of normal paper. They use their uh, logo print on that, and they put all the the details like uh, contact details and uh, address details. They keep on that. And they print. Okay. Usually, it is in uh, a four size a paper. Okay. So, as a designer, you also have to uh, do all the letterheads. At least two, uh, two, two, three letterheads. Everyone should have to do. Okay. So, here I want to give. Um, so, one more thing here. Mm, the hotel do some changes. This is looking plain. Now. So, instead of this. I'll give this uh, blue patch. I'll make this blue patch. Yes. Yes. I use this. This oval shape. And I'll keep here. Okay. fill with the, this color okay so yes move up and you can arrange and send back and this can be uh, white on dark color your text must be white okay now this piece this piece you can delete or otherwise you can leave it also as this day Suppose try to remove with shift. Yes, deleted this. Remove and this you can move down. Yes, move down and text can be bit down yes perfect okay and this also you can get that point inside same way this said also we do that same the 
this is this is uh, one kind of design okay so for for uh, different designs i'm giving so as a designer as a student you also have to do at least uh, uh, three designs okay so these are the uh, letterhead designs in adobe illustrator so we are using the same logo and the same uh, the text uh, we are using because this letterhead logo and business card and uh, envelope card these are the stationary items okay so stationary items means every company every individual ever uh, the marketing person or ever the industry person industry list ever one uh, they use their personal uses logo is rep representing your company and your brand name and the business card for the executive and the directors for the company officials people they use and the letterheads also for the official correspondence we use and for envelopes in the next uh, class I explain on envelope so envelopes also we use for the personal uses these letterheads you can fold it and you can keep inside uh, insert into uh, letterhead okay this letterheads you can keep inside your um, envelopes okay so these are the stationary items these four so you also have to plan your own uh, letterheads and this is the assignment one of the assignment is a third assignment okay so you plan it yourself if you have any doubt please ask okay thank you